bit bigger of an impact on the Monkey King, but there's not much you can do. Puppy's still staying bottom. You can't help him in that regard. Earth Spike coming out. CK is there. They do have the level one stun, level two reality rift, which is off cooldown in one second. Good two second stun plus the reality rift. The stomp comes out. The good stick charge. One more auto attack. Maybe the south comes out and ice 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 will survive for now. Jabs rotating in. Might find Puppy. The rock comes out. He gets the kill. They won't chase after Ace though. Too low is ice ice ice. They'll back themselves up. Very good kill coming in. Good rotation from Jabs. Now oh, they jump from the Monkey King. They've got the spirit siphon up. Mid one taking some damage. Is the flame guard going still? Now Nana needs to back himself up here, needs to be careful. Do they have the Searing Chains at the ready? Crypt Swarm comes out, there's the Bound to Strike. Good Fairy Fire, one more auto attack, they get the kill. Secret, turn it around. And now Ninja Boogie looking for a Thunder Strike kill onto mid one. Searing Chains comes again, there's the Glimpse of the Rot. Mid one still getting chased down. Japs wants this so bad and he will find it. And Yapsar can only watch as they lose his mid laner. All right, finally we get a little bit of a kill burst. Oh, and there, hook out of wow, three. That hook from Japs was sick, out of the tree. Beautifully done. Can they find Ninja Boogie though? Kinetic Field might keep him alive. Moon's coming back in. They have the Spirit Siphon. Maybe, I think it might be cool down. Actually, if one left, he's going to use the Crypt Storm along top of it. There's the hook just Ooh. connecting. Jabs. Oh. That looked like a Slacks' of sniper eggs. They're trying to find something. There's the extra sin. They're just going to go for the push on the tower. Yeah, I think they were hoping they could just catch one person, uh, but now they're just going to reveal Jab. themselves. Just running. There's the stampede. Hook is going to connect on Fada. I think it actually was skewering away, in fact, and that's a problem. Boundless Strike coming in. They've got the Thunder Strike. Crypt Swarm coming in back. They've got the Glimpse, and Fata will fall on the other side. Looking for another kill here. They've got the Astral of Ace in trouble. Arm the toggle. Double edge. One more oh. auto attack. These toggles are sick. Are you kidding me? How is he going to get out of this? One more toggle again. Yes. Ice, Ace makes it out. That is insane. And on the other side, Nana's going to get a double kill with the Exorcism. Plus, they are putting pressure on this tier one tower in the top lane. This vision is going to be crucial, especially for Jabs find some kills. They have the silence up. They need to glimpse. They're going to find it. There's the static storm, but he misses the kinetic field. The hook also missing. Mid one's going to run it away all the way towards the bottom rune spot. And he should be fine. And in the meantime, Ace will find a kill on Ice 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 getting dropped down. So they miss narrowly for Mineski and they lose a hero in the process. Now the Hex from Puppy. They've got the Earth Spike. Here comes Fada RP. Nice. On to two. Where's the skewer back? There's the kinetic field. It won't help them at all. They've got the Searing Chains. This is going to be used. The Wukong's command. This is a disaster for Mineski. The Glimpse back won't save them. It's three dead and Ace gets a mega kill spree. They might want to get more. Perhaps this tier one tower. But that is a great fight for Secret right there. Very good communication from the side of Team Secret. You can see, uh, you know, you talk about Bane with like Tiny Eye or something like that. You just get like sleep in to relocate. That's what that looked like. You just start off with one stun from the line into the hex. Plenty of time for the RP to come through from the TP. Yeah, fought a beautiful position for that blink RP. They will take Puppy and they will keep their tier one tower alive. There's not much. That Use your boundless, boundless strike. strike. Yeah. You don't do that much damage because you're support, but you can still just endlessly push waves and you're very hard to deal with. It's a lot like Caudal where you have to commit a lot. They're going to find Puppy here. He's been caught in the kinetic field. There's the Centaur Conqueror, rather Centaur Warrunner Ultimate. Good stun. There's going to be the RP oh, to the Wu King. Wu Kong's command coming out as well. Ace blows up one. They're about to get two more. The static storm was perfect, and now they should find these kills. They're going to have Stomp coming out from Ice Ice doing work. Great sanities. What a turnaround from Mushi. They're going to get the Aegis, but now Secret will back up. The Wukong's command is still there. They pop the Exorcism. They want the CK, and they're going to find it more than likely with a Dismember coming in. What a turnaround coming in from Mineski to find that fight. going From the side of Mineski, and that'll be the big fight that they're going to have to try and win from the side of Secret, but it helps if Disruptor's dead. Yeah, and they're going to find him here. The hook comes out. Fada, he's got the skewer available. They use the finger. They blow up the Disruptor, and now they've used the Stampede. And they're going to try to find something. RP onto two from Fada. The skewer back under the tier two tower. They've got damage. Where's the CK coming in? Jax is getting low at this point. They pop the extra send the Wukong's command coming out. Nana in trouble, getting caught and killed. Three dead. Secret with a great fight now for Mineski will lose. And that is a giant fight. A great RP again from Fada. He's hitting. So ends up in a pretty bad decision there from Mineski in the end. And uh, it'll be Secret pushing up the mid lane here a little Oof. bit. Good sentry, but Ninja Boogie's able to back up. And they're gonna push into this tier two tower. Glimpse back in. Fada needs to be careful. Oh, nice. Into the hook from Jazz and the kinetic field on top. Good boundless strike. Fada's not dead yet. He has no skewer. There's the static storm. He needs some help here. He's getting low. And they've got the stop at least onto one. One second cast ball. Puppy's in trouble. Earth's back onto two, but it will not save him. The urn charge taking him down. And they will hold their tier two tower. Ace on the run. They even have a 5k lead. It's 15 to 13 in terms of kill score, but taking all of these towers, taking the map control, certainly helped them. Puppy is spotted. There's a sentry there. The silence comes out. There's the Glimpse Kinetic Field. Not in time. And uh, instead, they will go for the stomp. Puppy, they drop another sentry in trouble. There's going to be the skewer out, the RP. And they've got the static storm, but it's missing. RP comes out finally. Sanity's dropped down. They're looking to get these kills. Two for two trades so far. And they blow up the third. Ace gets a double. Absolutely dominating Ninja Boogie and Nana. And now they're going to turn this into a tier two tower as well. You, you have to force something out of the Neski. 
And that's oh, yeah, sorry. Ice 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 is gonna jump in, misses the stun. No, he got it actually, but they missed the hook on the app, so he was stunned on the trees. Now coming in his mid one, drops the steering chains. Roshan getting about half HP. Yap Store coming through. They've got the Phantasm drop down. Good save with the Astro for Mushi. Now the real rack in. He's gonna use the KB and try to man fight this. Nana pops the exorcism. Three seconds stun. He does get the exorcism off, but there is going to be plenty of damage. The Wukong's command. They're looking to find Japs on the other side. Fata backing himself away. They will be one for one trade, but taking down Nana is the most important thing here. And Japs is going to be next. Mid one getting a double kill. They're looking for Mushi. They don't quite get the Siri change from mid one. So it's still a two for one trade, but you have Sora up in the trees. Jumping in is going to be the center. Stomp looked for, but he couldn't find it. Gets a stun for three seconds for Ace and gets blown away by Ace. The amount of damage he's doing is serious. The two man stun from the balance strike. Sandy just does nothing other than drain the mana and four dead. About to be five. A double kill for mid one. A perfect fight for Secret. Despite losing Fata, they will still clear out Mineski. This time around, no refresher shard. It's getting low. Jab is going to come in, look for a hook. He's going to miss just narrowly. Wasn't close enough. Good position positioning from Secret to be on the side of Roshan. They're going to jump in with Puppy. They get the Hex off. There's the Static Storm kind of missing. Puppy will get silenced up, but there's the Fata Skewer back. And Ninja Boogie will be the first to fall from Ineski as they try to all retreat away from Secret. Looking for some potentially on the jab. His TP will complete. No, the Siri chain. They don't even need the RP. Fata continues to cancel it. Into the Tier 3 Tower bottom. Ace will just be up front. Puppy looking for a Nerf Spike. Can't quite find something, but I mean, they're just gonna get Megas here. Mineski can only watch, still no Mushi. They might find Puppy, they missed the hook timing. They will get the kill nonetheless, but it is, again, just a lion at this point. Secret are so damn strong, they might not even need him. They're gonna pop the Wukong's command. They're going to work on the buildings. Nana is in with the exorcism, but look at the slide of this searing chain, do some serious work. He doesn't get the insta-kill, but he has done so much that it's ridiculous, and he blows away that poor Nana. Uh, Death Prophet, not only that, but he will find another in the Centaur. A double kill for him. He is just going ham right now. Middle oh, no, 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 no. There's the dismember. Can they find it to stop the Static Storm? But it's too little, too late. They hook onto Ace. Now he's in. He's going to find the triple kill. And GG is called. And Secret make it look easy in game number one, Trent. Uh, ultra kill there. And mid one is beyond godlike. No one could kill him. Yeah, are ahead by 20k and you still die. I think they're feeling pretty good after that first series win there up against EG. Yeah, they're back.